Hello and welcome ladies and gentlemen to Why This Game Now and today we'll be starting our first matchup with New York Knicks taking on the Charlotte Bobcats. So let's go into gameplay mode and let's just turn off the... I just wanted to turn off the... the commentary. <laughs> the commentary is on. I just want to turn it off. Let us go to options. Let's go to uh, game settings, presentation, and let us just turn off the commentary volume. Oh, it's already off. Oh, fantastic. So that's a good thing. I thought it was on. Let's just skip this I don't like all this <laughs> to be frank let us just change the volumes it's getting a little noisy you guys want to hear me talk right let's go to 5 and let's get the 2k beats in game off oh, fantastic mm, yeah so Sorry for that, all that interruption. Let's get back down to the gameplay. Oh shit. Just as I was about to start the matchup, I make the most basic of mistakes. That's a huge fail, ladies and gentlemen. I really hope that is not a sign of things to come because that was not a good start. We won the possession, but we gave away. It's going to be an interesting game because Charlotte Bobcats, uh, they're not a bad team. It's an average team if you look at it in comparison to others. But but somehow they might surprise you sometime, you know, just have that little bit of extra. And then really get to you and you will not be in that position. An easy shot for Carmelo Anthony. And as I was saying, Charlotte Bobcats can really surprise you sometimes and really, you know, uh, take you by storm and you're out of it you're out of, out of the game if they get a get a good start and they get into it early then you might lose it so we need to keep our composures and make sure that our plays are really really good oh that was a horrible horrible miss easy conversion going on to Felton now giving it to Shumpert Anthony Look at that. Oh, could have got the offensive rebound. It was not a good shot to begin, but I was really committed to the shot, so I really had to get on with it. So, went ahead with the shot, but uh, a total failure, I have to say. Oh, excellent block. Giving it to Felton now. Passing it on to Anthony. Schumpert. Chandler. And that's a foul with the basket. So that's a fantastic basket for the New York Knicks. It's a home game for us. So we're going to have that crowd advantage. The home ground advantage. People are going to be all into the game. Really shouting, you know. Really giving us that extra bit of home ground advantage that you get when you're playing in your own home. Let's go to Felton now. I'm playing it with the Xbox 360 controller for the Windows machine. I have to say, it is an amazing, amazing experience. If you are playing it with the keyboard, no sports games should be played with the keyboard. I really believe that you need to switch over to the Xbox 360 controller. It's a fantastic controller for the PC. It works in a jiffy. You don't have to do anything. Just plug it in and start playing. So. We've got a bit of uh, game going on. Look at that. Beautiful, beautiful play. Really drives the ball in, Shumpert, and he gets the conversion. A little bit off, off defense right now. A shooting foul, and the shooting foul is on Anthony. So Carmelo getting the shooting foul. We have gotten off to a good start. We haven't had 
lots of misses but whatever we have been doing we have been doing well and so that has helped us to get a fair amount of lead considering that every quarter is just four minutes long so you don't have a lot of time to really settle in it's a fast-paced action game kind of thing going on so you need to be in sync with your players immediately and get that rhythm or get that point uh, point scoring game going really quickly so that that makes it a really exciting game you know each game is a nail biter i have to say look at that stoudemeyer giving his all and a charging foul on him he's a really cool and calm customer i find him really the coolest of the lot for the new york knicks i mean he's really unpredictable what he can come up with uh, can blow your mind or really shock you like how the hell did he come up with that so, Stoudemire is the, really the X factor that I put in for the New York Knicks. But the New York Knicks have Carmelo Anthony, which they have, uh, whom they have acquired really a few years back. And I have to say that it's been a revelation. He is a fantastic player for the New York Knicks, and he has been their go-to guy for. For so many years now so he has done it well up until this point i really believe that if he gets along with uh, his other teammates he gels well he becomes a team player not that he's not but still you know they need to gel well as a team and once they achieve that they're going to be an a-class team no doubt about it a quick shot and I miss it by a whisker, I have to say. That was a really, really quick shot. Meta World Peace there. Uh, he's a player that I don't have much opinion about because I haven't seen him play that much because I wasn't a fan of the Lakers, which was his uh, earlier team, and I haven't seen uh, much of his game, so really it's not my, it's not my call. So this is my... Bench doing really well. Three pointer from Meta World Peace, but he misses from the rim. So my bench has done well as well. A really, really good game going on right now. Charlotte Bobcats are eight, New York Knicks at 10. So really, really good going for us up until this point. And let's get on with the second quarter now. playing it for the PC ladies and gentlemen and I just need to remind that the graphics do look much better than 2013 2k13 as it's called but the presentation hasn't changed a lot only a few minor changes here and there and it hasn't really gone really levels ahead as you would have expected it to go but still it's it's fairly there I mean it's not that they have not done anything but it's there Oh, and the shot is blocked. That was not a, a scoring opportunity, to say the least. Shouldn't have applied. Shouldn't have. Oh, two offensive rebounds. That's that's holy crap. You shouldn't be doing that in an NBA game. There shouldn't be back-to-back -back offensive rebounds given to the opposition. So my first team is somewhat back now, Chandler coming in giving it to Smith Banyani back to Smith Smith is a guy who can really change a game in an instant New York Knicks have a great player in him and they should really invest in him you know things can change with that guy in your team and I believe that once you have such a player who can really take you out of pressure and have you in control whenever you want to be that is something that you cannot compromise on really easily and out of bounds Bobcats will take possession so we have talked about the New York Knicks for a bit now and I believe that it's a strong team and they will improve with time so it's a force to be reckoned with in the coming seasons 
for us right now Carmelo Anthony is the guy he is the guy who is gonna win us all so we need to concentrate on him he's not on court right now but whenever he is on court we need to make sure that he plays really well look at that that could have been a fantastic dunk he was going right up there Smith going for the dunk but he was stopped right in his track with a foul and he gets to shoot free throws the first free throw goes in slightly late as you'll see the main interface the interface that gives you prompts hints scores uh, about what, how you're playing and all those kind of information has been changed it has been uh, revamped into something which is efficient I don't know maybe something you get used to after a certain amount of time but it is yeah it's good it's not that bad it comes up uh, in between telling you how you're playing the game what things you're doing right what things you should be doing and all those kind of things you know and Banyani doing his stuff post move score fantastic score by Banyani JR Smith now defending oh could have been a steal but goes out of bounds Bobcats retain possession Banani really, I don't know if I'm pronouncing his name correctly or not, but really compliments uh, Anthony. I, I believe that Banani is the guy who really brings in a lot of flavor to the New York Knicks and he compliments the style of Carmelo Anthony and they really have to build the team around Anthony now. They have to keep him in the center, build the team around him and make sure that they win based upon teamwork team play so that's what we're going to be concentrating 13 13 is the score we need to make sure that we get go into the halftime break with a lead and not trailing that's a jump shot from tyson chandler and i should really be laughing about it because it was a horrible shot really off time made a mistake defensively and they take the lead now 15 13 one minute to go let's see what we can come up with it's getting tight it is getting tight and that's going to be oh i thought that was a bucket by chandler but a good offensive rebound go to the free throw line free throws are a bit difficult in 2k14 that's what i've noticed i don't know if you guys have noticed it or not it's a little it's not there i would say the second free throw is easy it is the one you're gonna convert but the first free throw is a little off all the time and it, it's it's a lot about the action it's about how you throw the ball how the player rather uh uses his action for the free throw oh, i left him open and he still missed so that was a good thing so as i was saying free throw has really changed quite a bit i would say because it was not as difficult as I would remember from 2k13 in fact I still have that game installed on my PC and I sometimes do play it as well but I like it that much but with 2k14 I have been going around with 2k14 only and that's out of bounds that was a horrible shot <sighs> it's getting a little frustrating 21 seconds to go 17 14 my aim was to go into the halftime with the lead but it seems that we're not going to be able to do that unless we stop them and go for a three-pointer and still we'll be tied up we're not going to go into the lead so let's try and get them to commit a mistake that's it Shumpert is going to take the last shot oh that was really close that could have been a bucket to die for at half time 17-14 New York Knicks are trailing at the moment not a good sign not a good sign at all but half time means that we have half a game left so let's hope that in the third and the fourth quarter we are able to stage a comeback and win the game with a big big old margin so let's get started with the third quarter as you'll see the presentation of NBA 2k14 has not gone has not changed as much as you would have expected 
the next rendition to be but still it's okay because there was nothing wrong with 2k14 and and in, and in the way it presented the game so it's all right it's all good as they say fantastic defense by Chandler but he still manages to score a bucket so that is some good offense from the Bobcats so as I said Bobcats if they get going they can really really be difficult to control oh and that was Felton was all open and that's why I went in for the three-pointer but way off look at that block fantastic block there I think it was Shumpert who just two seconds to go they're gonna go with the shot already oh, makes it oh my god and that was Walker yes that was Walker who made that shot fantastic shot a timeout called now New York Knicks really deserve that timeout don't they So it's not been a good second half till this point. We haven't got on with the scoring yet. Let's hope and change it in this possession. And Tyson Chandler missing again. Oh, Tyson Chandler is frustrating me because I'm not able to nail my shot with him. Anthony with the steal. Shelton makes the layup. Fantastic, 16-21, we need to get momentum going on our side and I think that steal is going to help us do, do just that. And that's a timeout called by the Bobcats, they want to break up that momentum, really give us no opportunity. So let's get started again, 16-21 is the score, third quarter, 2-29 remaining in this one. Oh, and that was a good miss because really there was no no way they should have missed that one. Fantastic two-handed dunk by Anthony. And as I said, momentum needs to be in our that needs to be gained from our side. And we did doing just that with two buckets, which were really good buckets. A dunk and a bucket from a steal. Both had Anthony involved in it. Really difficult shot, really difficult changing the shot mid-air so New York Knicks all set Banyani going in for the layup but shooting foul on him it's a little difficult with uh, with the New York Knicks because you have players who can be a little dicey you never know what is gonna happen with this team you're not all confident like the Miami Heat or the LA Lakers you're not all confident about how this team will perform so it's gonna be a challenge as in when we go for each and every matchup that we have in this particular season way off so the Charlotte Bobcats are losing the track of their attack a little bit and now we are right on their tails we need to make sure And that is out of bounds. So I, as I was saying, we need to make sure that we keep this momentum on our side and score a few more buckets. Anthony is going to be the one who's going to help us. Oh, dropped it. I was going in for the fake. <laughs> I'm just all over the place right now. And he makes the bucket. Oh, God damn it wasn't expecting that 23 19 102 left in the third quarter it's a really tight game and we need to get ourselves together if we need to win this one oh shooting foul on anthony by gilchrist so the first Oh, free throw is off. Not having a great game, am I? Second one I'm able to convert easily. So let's get things going, ladies and gentlemen. We need to win this one. Oh my God, what the hell is wrong with me? 
I am going to go for a three pointer now. Easy three pointer for Schumpert. Thanks to a mistake by the Bobcats, I was left wide open and no problems for me. Oh, that could have been a three point game for us. But uh, Schumpert was fouled and he could not, could not convert. So as you'll see, the action really puts you off. You don't know when, when that sweet point is reached in the action where you need to release your X button. And it, it's really a tricky thing to handle. Schumpert has a great game going for him right now. And we need to make sure that we... We give him the possession. Fantastic block. Six seconds to go. And he makes the bucket. 1.5 seconds left. Fantastic. We have tied up the game at 26-26. What a fantastic comeback by the New York Knicks. Can you believe it, ladies and gentlemen? The third quarter comes to an end with 26 all. And the fourth quarter is going to be a make or break quarter for us. The momentum is clearly with us because we have had a great game. Shumper doing exactly what he set out to do. Stoudemire giving it his all but he does not convert. Oh my god, what the hell was that? Too many button presses. I don't believe what the hell is going on right now. Felton and that's a block by Anthony but that goes to goal tending. So 28-26. We did have a steal but we were not able to convert. Let's give it up to Shumpert. Banyani, Chandler. Chandler needs to work and he gets the bucket. So 28 28, 305 left. Fourth quarter. Turning out to be an excellent game. Really has its ups and downs for both the teams. Both teams making a good, good amount of effort. Both in the defense and the offense. And the game is turning out to be one of the most exciting games. Mistake. And let's see if we can capitalize. And that's a beautiful bucket by Anthony with the foul. <laughs> Isn't that amazing? Can we make it a three point game? Oh, and we don't, we missed the free throw. Anthony has a quick free throw action. So I needed to let go of the, of the X button really quickly, but I made a mistake. And they miss again, thanks to some great effort on defense by Banyani. Chandler missing on that one. Oh, and he gets the ball. Now Felton defending against Sessions. Schumpert. Going for the three-pointer, misses. And he gets the layup with the offensive rebound. So, we make a mistake. Yes, we do make a mistake. We don't defend him well. And the scores are level 30, 30, 151 to go. It's getting on my nerves now, ladies and gentlemen. A really difficult game if you look at it. Has had its highs and its lows. And a kick ball violation by Sessions. So it's going to be Nick's ball. Really breaks up the flow, doesn't it? Oh, that was a bad pass. But we recover thanks to some luck. Oh, now, oh my God. Made a mistake. And now Banyani is defending. Really good defender. 
Fantastic. Banyani was really good in that possession now. 30 30 is the score. Really, we have to get things going. Charlotte are defending really well, but I think it's going to be a layup. Yes, Banyani finds the way. Good layup for him and a good layup for New York Knicks. 32 30. Really, really tense. The fourth quarter, one minute, three seconds to go. Really, really, really tense, I have to say. It's going, getting right to the crowd, right to us. And if you have stick around, suck around up until this point, you're going to believe that basketball is one of the most thrilling games or sports on this planet. And this is exactly the reason why. Oh my god, that is a fantastic bucket by Walker. Kemba Walker doing his stuff. Right, right. We have to get the ball really moving. From way outside and he, he misses out of bounds oh my god this is going to be a hell of a game 32 32 23.4 seconds to go and the clock difference is i think 1.4 seconds they are going to take their time on this particular possession i don't know what to do Should we foul and let them go to the line? What is, I, I don't know what the hell is going to happen. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm really, really tense right now. And it's going to be a dead ball. Oh, it's a tie game. Going to OT now. Oh my God. It has gone to a tie game. We're going to overtime and we get the possession. Fantastic. Tyson Chandler making no mistake. Points in the paint 18 to 22, 22. So not a big difference, but there is a difference over there. Showing that we haven't scored as many points as Bobcats have inside the paint. And that's a steal. Look at that. J.R. Smith. Beautiful layup. 36-32. Charlotte are now trailing by four points. And just like that, 131 to go in OT. Felton really on. Now Chandler. As I was saying, Felton was really, really good on defense. Left him open, he gets the bucket, 34-36. What a matchup. Shouldn't be making a mistake right now. Concentrate on getting the ball right inside the paint. That's, that's going to be my strategy now. Should be an easy shot, gets it. 49 seconds to go, 34-38, New York Knicks are leading. What a game, I have to say. What a game for New York. Oh, that was really bad defense. A good screen. Good screen by Bobcats on that last possession. Oh, made a mistake, 36-38. They shouldn't convert. And they do, 38, 38, 27.8 seconds to go, oh my god. This is an important possession for us and we make a mistake. The ball goes out of bounds and now Bobcats have the possession, 38, 38, with 24.8 seconds to go. Virtually no difference between shot clock and game clock. A really, really difficult time for the New York Knicks. We have to defend well. This is going to be it. Make or break. We 
we saw those saw, saw some lag over there I don't know what that was all about I really hope that we get this one oh yes he misses fantastic take the shot sorry ladies and gentlemen the game was so good that even my recorder gave up so we are into the second overtime we missed we missed that's right we missed the last second shot and Tyson Chandler gets his bucket 40 38 have you seen a matchup like this ever before what a fantastic matchup Tyson Chandler on the other end now defensively does his job well fantastic off to Schumpert Schumpert has had a great game today goes for the three-pointer and he scores it yes 43 38 122 left to play and this has been the first game in the season can you imagine the first game has gone into second overtime it has been that kind of matchup charlotte bobcats are not an easy team at all and they have proved proved it today and it has been a really really good game all on entertainment for everyone easy shot for Carmelo Anthony 45 38 47 seconds I really hope that my recorder does not give in again and it's gonna go out of bounds yes it is out of bounds Charlotte Bobcats have lost possession Knicks will take on possession and it has been a very good second overtime for us now oh that's a steal from the Bobcats oh I left him open just as I said that we have had a good second overtime look at that two-handed dunk oh yeah 25 inches vertical that's a joke amazing dunk and really splendid game splendid 47 40 19 and a 19 and a half seconds to go i don't think they're going to make a comeback now it's going to be an easy win for us 40 45 they still would have a chance but 40 47 i don't think that they have a chance and it's out of bounds next ball 18.2 seconds to go they're going to foul now that's what i am thinking they're not fouling yet so we can just play it out now keep the ball in our hands or just keep passing and take a last second shot here we go and he misses but 40 47 is the final score the first game of the season for the new york knicks and we win it we, but we win it not in style but with some grace i have to say went down to the wire twice with the final score being tied and the OT score being tied so we had to go to second overtime but we finally get the job done 40 47 the final score New York Knicks beat the Charlotte Bobcats in their first game of the season if you have watched till this point I really really appreciate it so thank you for watching and do keep in touch for my future videos